Fairfield County is using some of the money received from a lawsuit over the failed reactor project at VC Summer to bring educators to the area. News 19's Rachel Ripp has the details. A shovel full of dirt representing years of work to build a new teacher village in Fairfield County. When they started talking about this teacher village, I'm like, yes, please, we need it really, really bad. 22 acres of 75 single family homes created by the district to make living more affordable, conveniently located and supportive to teachers. It could be, you know, 8.30 at night and you really want to talk to somebody about something that you're trying to plan for a lesson maybe for that next morning and you want to roll it off someone else's back, you know, and let them kind of give you their input. I would be able to do that. Audrey Brown has been a history teacher for Fairfield Central High School since 2018. She'll be one of the first to live in this new village, and she says she sees incredible benefit from this concept. I think that it would really encourage new teachers to come here because it would be a full community that would be able to back them when they needed it, be able to support them. According to Fairfield County School leadership, 70% of teachers in Fairfield County don't stay. The more stressed out a teacher is from finances, from having to travel so far, not getting enough rest, all those things impact what you're able to get to the kids. The district says the village is a solution to that problem. Reporting in Winsboro, Rachel Ripp, News 19, WLTX. In all, the school district got $2 million from Dominion Energy as part of the lawsuit. That covers about half of the cost of the village. They plan to take out a loan for the remainder of the funds. District leaders say the first home in the village will be ready sometime next year.